first tonight at six, a Liberty neighborhood is feeling left in the dark, experiencing frequent power outages for years. A homeowner living there reached out to KSHB 41 for help, and we found out he's not alone. The frustration lies of never knowing when and never knowing how long. It'll be like bright and sunny, hardly any wind, and then we're without power for four hours. KSHB 41 News reporter Caroline Hogan is amplifying the voices of neighbors frustrated and feeling defeated. So she took their concerns to Evergy. Chad Light moved into this home on La Chateau Drive in 2012. During those 10 years, he experienced frequent power outages, so much so he decided to move. But let me show you where. And the problem followed him right across the street. The frustration lies of never knowing when and never knowing how long. Chad Light feels like he's in the dark. But again, we get no answers. And he has a list to prove it. October 3rd, power went out uh, for eight and a half to nine hours. October 18th, power went out again uh, for about an hour. Just yesterday, the 6th, they went out and was out for a little about hour and a half, hour and 45 minutes. He calls Evergy every time an outage happens. Across the street, his neighbor Jessica Graves has the same issue. I mean, it's been over to where I can't even estimate. It's a nuisance, definitely. Evergy replaced power lines and added boxes in early 2022. That didn't solve all the problems. It seemed to be getting better. We just haven't seen the results that we wanted to see with consistent power. In fact, Light and another neighbor we talked to noticed it made the problem worse on their side of the street. I thought by moving from one place to another, uh, I would avoid the issue, but it looks like I've moved from one, one place to another nightmare. Evergy said they're aware of the issue, and both sides of the street run through a different line. The side of the street Light lives on, they've noticed it has had, quote, an unusual number of blinks or outages. They're going to come and check out the problem. Until then, Chad Light hopes he's not left in the dark. I don't feel like I'm asking for the world, just power. In Liberty, Caroline Hogan, KSHB 41 News.